Hey guys, and welcome back to Countdown Vampires. When we last left off, we were in a pretty rough way, actually. Yeah, we just used all of our darts, which is bad. And we only have our handgun left, which is bad. But, oh, bloody hell. We've still got more of those guys everywhere. Well, oh man, we're going to go straight through there and then round the corner. Right. Now, the trouble really is we have no darts. And the game has just literally thrown 600. Oh. Oh. The hell is that? Um. Is that a. Is that a vampire bat? Oh my. Yep, that hurts. Oh dear. Oh god, right, well. Ow. We're probably on danger. Yep. That's fine. Glad we have this. Ow. God, those things hurt. The shotgun's cool. But she's a little bit slow. Come and get me, you big ugly flying bastard. Oh dear. <laughs> yeah, let's make sure we have ammo in our gun before we start shouting at these guys. Oh, dude. Okay, I don't know if we can actually get away from them. Oh, man. Holy shit. Those things are pretty rough. It's a good thing we had all those shotgun shells, to be honest. Oh, fucking hell. Okay. Right, so, we can now go through there. That was rough. Jesus. Gamble up some more money there, but we don't really care. Yeah, uh, not sure how we can realistically run away from those things. They're nasty. Ooh. Here was me expecting to have thousands of enemies in here. Please, can we have a good supply of stun darts? I mean, yes. Rifle magazine, that's alright, I guess, but... Oh, spooky. But we had to use that on the other door. Oh no, not card games. Not card games. Right, so I guess we need those for the clocks. Ugh, okay, fine. Let's let's uh let's have a little look around. Can I have some like stun darts game? Seriously? Uh, my god, you just literally gave me a load of rubbish. I really need some stun darts. Uh, well, you know, I mean, uh, AR-15, A3 a is pretty, pretty, pretty cool too. Um, but in all seriousness, stun darts, please. Okay, we've got another weapon. Oh, well, being an AR-15, I'm guessing it's not automatic. Uh, so, I'm guessing it's a single shot weapon. Which is fine, <clears throat> you know. Um... <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, so I'm, yeah, I'm, uh, right, we'll, we'll use the spear key here. That's thrown me off a little bit because I would have thought that the spear key would have been used um, on the spear door, but maybe there's another spear key, I guess. Please be stun darts. I don't ask you for a lot, game. Yes! Okay. All is right and happy with the world once more. We have... 
Too many weapons. Oh yeah. Can't reload because it wants the other more powerful darts. Okay, so what's in the box? We could examine. Oh, excuse me. I'm really tired. For some reason. Very tired considering I haven't actually, you know, done much. Okay, um Let's get you out of there. Man, those are just so freaking easy. Oh, that candy bar. Seriously? I mean, <clears throat> sure, we'll take it, I guess. Would have liked to save room. Okay, now. So I guess we can pick up these things. These things over here. What? What? What is this bullshit here? Okay, I mean, I guess we can't actually do anything with that. Oh, no, we can. 1-8 Jack King. Uh, hope we get my tablet. So, there are four cards, <coughs> apparently. And those cards are... It's junk. On my tablet, there we go. So there's a one, there's eight, and Jack, and a king. Right, I think it's worth noting, I'm pretty sure I've said this before in my other videos, I don't know anything about card games because they literally don't interest me in whatsoever. They never have. Usually I hear someone mention cards and think I'd rather go blow my brains out with a shotgun. Um, but hey, uh, I'm sure we'll figure it out. So we've got a door behind us that we can go through. So yeah, those weird vampire bat things. Oof, man. Not exact. Oh, hello. Not exactly a good time, were they? Oh, German shells. Yeah, don't mind if I do. Uh, okay, so we've got some like shotgun shells up here. What are these? There's something that looks like a clock. The hands are shaped like spears. Okay. Wait, can we not take that? So it looks like something's missing there. All right, is there one on the other side? So the hands are shaped like spears. Where? What's that clock pointing at? So that one is pointing to 10. Red spear to 10. Red. Guessing this is going to be needed. Red spear. 10. Oh, it actually says it there on the card next to it as well. 10. Okay. I mean, it doesn't really help us, I don't think, because I th thought we would get some kind of clock hands or something. And then this one. Uh, looks like a clock. So that's three, pointing to three. Blue clock. Pointing to three. <laughs> so we're getting loads of numbers and shit. It's... Uh, okay. I wouldn't say it's an enjoyable um, time. All these numbers. <clears throat> uh, numbers are one of those things. Oh, coffee. Numbers are one of those things that I find also incredibly soul-shatteringly boring. Like, I couldn't be an accountant or anything like that, for instance. I just, I, I don't know. I don't know how they do it. I mean, if you are, 
more power to you. Hat off to you, but oh god, I don't know. Right, what's around this corner? Oh, ah, a vending machine. Sure. Let us partake in the ritual of capitalism. Ah, oh, this vending machine's got everything in it. How many item slots do we have? That might be worth looking at. Ah, not many. Okay, so it might be worth making some kind of mental note. That... There is an untapped... Um, a very untapped vending machine in that corner. Ooh. The place you get to has a pipe. Uh. Okay. We possibly try that again in English. I literally have no idea what the hell that was about. The place you get to has a pipe. Uh, okay. Hmm. There's nothing in here. Oh, we can go gambling, I guess. But I really don't think we need to. I would like some more stun darts. I feel like we could never ever have enough stun darts. Because those vampires, yo. Wow, we're getting a lot of AR-15 ammo. Should I be concerned? Ooh, that music though. Should I be concerned about the fact that we're getting an absolute metric ton of... Uh, dump, uh, dump truck? Why, why have I got dump trucks in the mind? Uh, <laughs> I actually have. Oh, God, I've said that a couple of times now. Um, yeah. We're getting an absolute ton of this stuff. Read the files. It has numbers from 1 to 10. There's a mark stamped under the numbers. Oh, God. First game. I don't know what that is. There's no context. You've got one, two, three. And then you've got, there's no other. Okay, uh, sure. Oh, okay. Nine millimeter, we'll have it. We'll have it. What's this do? A machine that plays... Oh! Machine that plays Kino. I don't know what Kino is. But sure. I wonder if we can use our ticket thing on that. Maybe. Guess we'll find out. So what else we got here? Oh, more shotgun shells. Damn. Really giving us the shotgun shells. I guess that's not usable. The fuck is that? I don't read chicken scratch. Probably Japanese, I guess. Okay, well that's pointless. Um... Right, I'm guessing we need the Kino ticket. Although I'm not sure what that's going to actually give us, to be 100% honest with you. Uh, wasn't this door locked from the other side? Does that mean that we can open this door? I don't know if anybody watches my channel that's Japanese. Read Japanese? I'd love to see if... They could tell me what that means. Uh, no, we've gone the wrong way. Why would you have Japanese text? Like, that's just so out of left field, man. Like, what's the context to that? 
they just is that an oversight by the developers i mean i guess so oh good lord all oh, right okay cool so we can now exit this way and yeah we did clear out all the bad necks earlier so we should have a straight shot to an item room which is good right so we've got so many bloody num oh oh what the fucking hell is that motherfucker well bat i got something for you yes i guess these guys come in twos that's fine really oh that's gonna leave a mark oh that's gonna leave a mark Oof. get some more shells in this thing bloody hell i say sir pretty rough customers bloody hell Now we took a rather nasty knock or two from that. Gruesome twosome. That's fine. Good thing we have all these shotgun shells. Shotgun is an absolute unit. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, I wouldn't mind. Oh, yeah, we opened. Did we open that one? We must have opened that one. We've opened them all, right? Yep, must have. Okay, so. We've just got such a collection of numbers. To do with this bloody lock puzzle thing now. And the key, we need the Kino ticket. Whatever the fuck that is. I I've never heard of Kino. Shock, right? Alright, let's drop a save. Because we're starting to find some nasty, gribbly monsters now. Items. Now. What? Let's drop that. Because I'm not convinced we realistically need it. My god, we have so much ammo. We're not combined. So you can only have 45 in one stack. Interesting. Okay. Okay. Uh, and the... That's the stun globe. We've got low, so much health there. Ay, caramba. Alright. Let's get out of that. And let's drink a juice box. Now. Do we have any more mail? Wait, do we not have any mail at all? Uh, guess not, all right. Not sure what that's about. Pretty sure we had loads of mail before. Okay. You do you, game. You do you. I'm not here to judge. Right, let's go back. Be nice if we could, like, bump into some shotgun shells that we maybe forgot to use. I think it's this door. Yep. It'd be nice if the opened doors wouldn't be red be nice if the open doors were just yellow like the other ones i don't know that's a really strange design choice if you ask me really bloody strange uh sydney let's go back to sydney i don't understand why we use a nancy card to open sydney and stuff like that i i, I, I yeah there's a lot about this game which just does not make sense you know but I'm guessing we use that there. 
Oh. Are you seriously meant to write all this stuff down? Holy fucking shit. Really? So we've got to go into file. Was it even in file? Memo. Right. Oh, bloody hell. Uh, okay, it has numbers from 1 to 10. Jesus Christ. Well, this is a load of old shit, isn't it? Uh, right. So, we need a 10, 1, The 10 grid. How many down is it? One, two, seven. It's seven down. Okay. This is just a bit silly. Like, you know. I like doing stuff like this, where it's warranted. But this just seems really silly, the fact that I've now got to draw out a graph. I mean, I don't know, Kino. Maybe I'm putting too much into this. I've never even heard of it. And that's hoping that I can actually replicate this properly because, you know, I'm a bit special. All right, so that's me grid drawn out. So, one, So that's one, two, got X there. We have next row over two, so four and five. We have X, X. Now down to three. Now in three, we have eight. Eight has also got an X on it. Three down. Uh, two has an X. Four down. Two. Uh, and then nine also has an X four down. Um, and then six has one five down. Six has an X five down. If I had my phone, you know, I'm I'm way over complicating this, is aren't I? But I just use my phone, take a photo of it, you know, like a, a smart human being. I actually thought I had left my phone in the other room. Well, you can count yourself lucky you're not as dumb as me. Okay. So, first game. Uh, it's still not exactly 100% clear what we're going to get from this. If anything. If any real use. Okay. I'm going to go straight ahead. Run, my dude, run! God, what a load of ass. I actually drew the grid out and everything. <clears throat> I suppose another acceptable thing running out on an emulator is you could screenshot it and print it out a uh, print it out as well. Wait a minute. 
we were in the right area. I think. There we go. Yeah. So let's try that again. Now let's see what happens if we replicate it. A machine that plays Keno or Kino or whatever. Right. First game. I'll oh, put the ticket in, you dingus. You need me to hold your hand whilst you cross the road. All right. Enter the numbers. Yeah. So one. So we've got one there. Four. Sleep. Um. All right. Four. Five. Okay, and then we drop. Oh, passwords and ah, oh, for fuck's sake! Right. So we can only pick three numbers. I'm guessing we have to go through all the numbers that we have learnt in the last bloody few videos which is a lot <laughs> um you know right so the cards yeah but that doesn't join them up ah uh. I mean, we can't, all right. Oh yeah, we can't actually properly look at it, can we? Oh man. I have no idea how we find this out. Because there's a lot of numbers it could be. Right, one second, guys. Let's see if I can fiddle around with this off camera. Okay, guys. So I'm back after an adventure into town to uh, meet the missus. Uh, right, I only got a few minutes of this video left. Oh, uh, oh, oh, yeah. We were trying to work out the puzzles, weren't we? Um, a machine that plays Kino. I don't actually know what Kino is. If I connect my headset so it doesn't come out of my PC speakers, it's probably a good idea. Uh, yeah, because we got all this gobbledygook, haven't we? Uh, these puzzles do appear to be, like, really complicated. It has numbers from 1 to 10. There's a mark stamped under the numbers, which is fine, but that doesn't... This doesn't tell us any anything. Uh, did we? I also don't like the way these files are um, labeled either. Staff memo. Oh, Kino ticket first game. Zero zero zero. Yeah, it doesn't mean anything. It, 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 what? Okay. Oh, right. Uh, okay, 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 okay. So, is there something else in this room? Apart from the roulette machines? I mean, we could go gamble some cash away, but that seems to be a little bit silly. Uh, we did have those cards, didn't we? Let's go look at those cards again. Where was... Oh, that... Was that back through that corridor? I think so. Yeah, you have to bear with me, guys. It's been... <laughs> it's been a split second for you. It's been about three... Three, four hours for me. 
Uh, right, okay. Let's let's go back, check out... Because we got the clock thing. Well, they were like half cards. But they're half cards, though. Like, that doesn't give us any information at all. Does it? Unless you need to know what the value of cards are. Which I will have to look that shit up. Because I don't know what the value of cards are. Because I don't play cards. I hate cards. Well, I've already been over... Right. I've already been over this. I did write this down, actually, didn't I? There's something that looks like a clock. The hands are shaped like a spears. Oh, I wonder if those are actually the keys. Because it, it was a double spear door, wasn't it? There's two... Uh, anyway, so three. Three doesn't really tell us anything, though. And I've got that written. Oh, look at the diagram I've drawn earlier. Three. The only thing, maybe, hang on. Hang on. What's this in the middle? All right. One, eight. Jack King. I mean, one. I don't know what one is, and I don't know what eight is. But I. Th it, is. G I don't know what a jack is. Is ki I think kings are ten. I know an ace can be a one or a ten, I think. I think. I don't know. I don't play cards, goddammit. Um, four cards. Uh, unless maybe the right so we know one eight and jack king yeah i've got all that written down anyway oh another cool thing about this emulator is it will pick up uh, if my, because I use an Xbox controller for this, um, if my controller goes to sleep, that used to really upset EPXE, um, and it wouldn't recognize it again unless I closed the emulator down and reopened it. This doesn't care if your controller goes to sleep or not, it will just pick it straight back up. See, that's a 10. The other one was a 3. Right. How many numbers was it? See, I, th I can't remember how many numbers we need. Is this the right way? No, it's not the right way. So, was it three numbers we needed? What is it with this game in three? Like three letters for a password. This is really a bit odd. Right, let's go back down Susie. And this coffee that I made about three hours ago has gone cold. A lot of people don't like cold coffee. Cold tea. I actually really like cold coffee and cold tea. Don't judge. Or judge, I don't know. Um, this is a bastard, isn't it? I mean, so we've got one eight. We've got 10 and we've got 3. And let... Hang, ooh, am I being incredibly dim here? Oh, no, because there's four numbers there. There's... How many numbers? I think there's three numbers that we need here. Because that's the confusing thing. Because, like... 1, 8, Jack and King. Uh, right, let's use this bad boy. So, right, so you've got 10. So, one, where's my phone? Oh, yes, yeah, in the other room, isn't it? No, it's in my pocket. Right, let's have a look at our 
doodad. Uh, I know I could just look this up, but and you know if if I have to, I will. But that's not as much. All right. So okay. So maybe maybe one means that we need to input twenty one. Maybe eight. What's eight? Eight is three down, which is thirty-eight. But the thing. I mean, because there's only three bloody numbers. That's the thing. But we've got four. We have four bloody um, clues. But I'm sure there's only... Oh, wait. Hang on. Yeah. Yeah. So there's only three numbers here. God damn it. I hate the fact that we have to put this. So I wonder... It's just the Jack and the King that are throwing me off. So if we enter the numbers, say, say I'm right. Which I hope I am because if it's not, I don't really know. I, I I'm out of ideas. So one would be. Don't go to sleep. One would be twenty-one, and then eight would be. Uh. Eight would be three, three down, which would be twenty-eight. But then, what's next? All right, I think I'm going to call it here, guys. I'm going to fart around with this quite a bit off camera, I reckon. And when I come back, I hopefully would have worked it out. Ah, uh, yeah, because you don't want to see me scratching my head for like. 30 minutes. So, thanks for watching, guys. As always, next time.